News. The Herald and News. Sunrise Headlines. Your headlines now. Good morning, Klamath Basin. It's Thursday, December 13th, 2018. I'm Kurt Lipke with The Herald and News. Here are a few stories you can find in today's edition of The Herald and News. These are your Sunrise Headlines. Weeks of work for local dancers across the Klamath Basin culminate next week when the Eugene Ballet Company makes its annual return to Klamath Falls for a performance of The Nutcracker at the Ross Raglan Theater. All three Klamath Falls dance schools collaborate for the annual affair, taking dancers from young children to high school seniors for a rare opportunity to share the stage with professional dancers. There will be two performances of The Nutcracker on Tuesday at 2 p.m. and 7.30 p.m. Tickets range from $19 to $29. Following multiple resignations and difficulty in finding replacements, the town of Lakeview is changing tact to fill its roster for the Lakeview Police Department by contracting with the Lake County Sheriff's Office. Lakeview Police Department has been without a permanent police chief since the departure of Will Behan, who resigned in June after barely three months on the job. Attempts to find a replacement police chief resulted in only one applicant who resigned several days after their scheduled start. Now the town of Lakeview, rather than search for new candidates for its police department, is attempting to initiate a contract with the Lake County Sheriff's Office for recruiting and employment transfers. It started as a group effort between two Klamath Falls Farmers Market product vendors, Edible Earth Farms and Violet Ray Remedies, last fall. Now the Edible Earth Farms Collective, along one of these storefronts at the historic Oregon Bank Building, has goods from more than 30 different vendors from the farmers market on year-long rotation, serving as a veritable year-round farmers market. Entering its second year in the Klamath Basin, the Singing Christmas Tree presented by Triad School has grown in its sheer scale, number of participants, and opportunities to see it in person. Taking place at BBC Ministries Friday and Saturday at 7 p.m. and on Sunday at 3 p.m., the event gathers more than 150 participants together for a Christmas-themed concert featuring choir, orchestra, a living nativity scene, and elements of Charles Dickens' A Christmas Carol. Tickets are $10 in advance or $12 at the door and $5 for kids under 12. And those are just a few of the stories you can find detailed in today's Herald and News. Follow us across various social media sites and heraldandnews.com. Check back often for latest podcasts, videos, and breaking news. Good morning, Klamath Basin, and enjoy your day.